Welcome. In this video, we're going to use the limit laws to evaluate limits algebraically. So please pay attention, close attention to the table at the beginning of your notes. Here it is again on your screen. I have labeled each of these rules alphabetically. Take a moment to label your notes so that these match. I will be referring to these alphabetical labels throughout this video. So our first step is to use A, so I'm just going to write by A, we can rewrite this as the limit as t approaches 2 of t squared plus the limit as t approaches 2 of negative 3t plus the limit as t approaches 2 of 4. And again that's by A and I went ahead and moved my label to the right. Now, by f, we can rewrite this first one as the limit as t approaches 2 of t, and this is quantity squared, and that's, and that is by f. Additionally, by c, I can pull this constant out to the front of the limit. So we have 3 times the limit as t approaches 2 of t, and again, that's by c and I'm not going to do anything to this last part on this step. Okay, so now we can evaluate this limit here. The limit is t approaches 2 of t, and that is by h. So in this case, we just replace the t here with 2, so this becomes 2 squared, and again I used rule h. I can do the same thing here that is replace the 2, excuse me, replace the t with the 2 again by rule h. And then finally, this limit here is evaluated using g. That is the limit as t approaches a value of a constant is just going to equal the constant, and that is by g. And I went ahead and color coded this a little bit better. So at this point, all that's left to do is simplify. We have 4 minus 6 plus 4, and we end up with 2. I hope this video was helpful.